when did the idea of a, an American record first go into your head? Like um, a year ago in high school? At, at any um, distance, did you think about that? I didn't even know what the American record was last year when we were in 350. We were trying to run maybe the collegiate record, but didn't even know about that. So um, I think once we saw that, we kind of marked it on the calendar a year out. But then it got closer and we actually were like, okay, we have a possibility of getting this American record. So um, yeah, it's been kind of a goal uh, in mind. It kind of sucked to PR, but not get it just because it was so close. But I mean, yeah, we've been thinking about it for a while and you know, now we got another year to think about it a little bit more. But for now, I think, you know, it's just a step in the right direction. Felt really good doing it even not feeling great coming into the meet. So um, yeah, I think we're just excited about where we are. Again, I think we're still a little bit farther ahead than we were last year. And um, you know, we're just gonna keep trying to keep this trend going and um, you know, compete well at USA's and uh, keep it rolling from there. So is there any time to give another attempt or USA's is too close? Uh, yeah, I think USA's is too close. We, we're definitely on like a two week racing cycle. So we're gonna go in get get some more work done and then um, yeah, going to USA is trying to feel healthy and uh, bring home a title. Gotcha. Either one of you is going to Indoor World, is that right? Uh, I think the plan is uh, not to go to Indoor Worlds. Um, you know, definitely want to like make sure that we know we can make that team. Um, so we're going to go race our hardest. But yeah, I think we have a lot more incremental things and in leading up to World Champs. And, um, you know, a, a big trip to Serbia is uh, a lot. And we maybe have some more races pretty quickly after uh, indoors so yeah probably not going to worlds full such a great character that must be really affirming you to to out kick him in two indoor races this season yeah i think i mean cole's shown it um and obviously we're so so early on in the season and in the year um it doesn't mean as much as maybe if i do it three months from now but yeah it's just uh definitely kind of affirming of where i am and that i'm progressing just because i've seen him do it with the pros so uh just to be able to be there and kind of um, competing, and especially with a guy like Cole, who I see every day just absolutely go murder workouts. So it's cool to be with him doing that, and um, I think we have a pretty cool dynamic going. Oh, let's go! Oh, let's go cool down. Just one yeah. last thing. Did did it feel really tiring? Did it feel? Did it feel smooth? Um, what was the it body definitely. Like? I think it felt harder than last year from the gun. I didn't feel as smooth. I think last year was just like kind of brain was off, and we were just going. But this year, I think when you have it in your mind that you want to run this time, it's a little scarier than when you just go and randomly run 350, which is kind of how it worked last year. But uh, I mean, I think you could see when we finished, neither of us were like keeled over. We were looking at the time, hoping we got it. But um, at the end of the day, I think there's a little more left in the tank if we uh, do it, run the race a little differently, so. And just mentally, like before the race, you feel yeah, I just think pure focus? What, we were locked in, we were ready to go, but we are ready Great to have job. fun with it. Thank you. Yeah, any nerves? Definitely a little nervous, so once you get on the line, it's just like excited to be here. Yeah, well, great race. So let's yeah. go cool down. Thank you, appreciate it. I gotta say, very.